Hi guys. Good evening. Hi, good night. Hi, teacher. Hi, how are you doing? I'm at the church. <laughs> You're what? I'm the church. I'm at the church. Oh, you are. <laughs> ah, really? The pronunciation of uh -huh, church. Yeah. Church. Yes. You're at church. Oh, okay. But I'm going to my house right now. Oh, okay. Okay. I see. Okay. All right. Well, we'll, we'll be waiting for you. But I'm great. <laughs> okay. okay. And you? No worries. I'm, How are you, teacher? I'm pretty good. Thank you. Yes. Um, all right. Well, okay. no worries. Whenever you. You can um, connect from your house that, you know, you can go ahead and, and connect. That's no problem. No? Ah, okay. <laughs> okay. All Thank right. You. Well, good to see you guys. How was your, your weekend? Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good, good. Um, it's good to see you. How are you guys doing today? Happy. Yeah, you're happy? Oh, good. Why? Why are you happy? Because my, tomorrow is, is day off. Oh, yes, I know. <laughs> okay, so tomorrow you rest. Yes. Oh, nice, nice. Okay, lucky you. <laughs> tomorrow and the the next part of the week. Oh, nice. Tomorrow and next part of the week. <laughs> Why? What do you mean? The other days of the of the week. Oh, really? Why? It's part of the vacation. Oh, nice. Okay. So you have your vacation in this in this time? Yes, Wednesday. Oh, okay. Nice. Nice. Okay. Well, I hope you have a wonderful vacation then. Thank you. I hope so. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> okay, good, good. All right. Well, guys, um, can you guys help me out with your camera so we can take attendance? If you guys can do that for me, that'd be wonderful. Okay, so let's open up those. Teacher. Hi. Hi. Uh, I'm still working right now. I won't be able to open the camera today because it's complicated for me. Okay, um, I need you at least to open up the camera when uh, we take attendance. Can you do that for me? Okay. Okay. Um, yeah, because we need we need to uh, be able to to see your face when you say present. <laughs> okay. All right. Um, okay, good. So I still have lots of people that I still don't see their cameras on. So if you guys can help me with that. Okay. Um, present. <laughs> okay, good, good. I haven't actually um, gone ahead and, and taken attendance because I'm still waiting for everybody to open up their cameras. Okay, all right, guys. So now we're going to start. Give me a moment. By the way, it's good to see everybody. I hope everybody had a good weekend. I hope you had a, a relaxing weekend. Did you guys have a relaxing weekend? Yes? Yes. Oh, good, good, good. I'm glad to hear that. Okay. Excellent. Okay, so we're going to um, take the attendance. Give me a moment. Okay. All right, so Anna, Anna sorry, Annie? Okay, wonderful. And Ana Maria? Ana Maria? No, Ana Maria is here? No? Um, Emily, sorry, no, sorry. 
Carolina. Carolina. Carolina has not connected yet. Okay. Okay. Oh. Uh, teacher, she say she was. I know, I know, I know. Okay. Yeah, but she said she was going to be connecting. That's why she said that she was going to be connecting. Um, so that's why I was wondering. But thank you, thank you for reminding me. Okay, let's see. Let's continue. Um, Emily. Emily. Good evening. Present. Okay, welcome, Emily. Thank you. And Hazel? Hazel? No, no, Hazel? Okay. Uh, what about Joanna? Hi, present teacher. Good oh, evening. Good evening, welcome. Thank you. Okay. Um, Give me a second. Se me trabaja esta cosa. <laughs> okay. Sorry, guys. My computer sometimes goes wacko on me. Um, okay. Eh, Jorge? Present teacher. Okay. Sorry, did it, Hazel? Hazel, no, right? Ah, no sé. Sí, Hazel, but I don't know why she cannot. Present teacher. Ah, oh, okay. There she is. Okay. I have uh, some trouble with the internet. Oh, okay. 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 No problem. All right. Now I can see you though. Excellent. Thank you. Okay. Um, Jorge, right? We have Jorge. Present. Wonderful. Karina. Present. Excellent. Welcome. And Carla. Present. Okay. Welcome, Carla. And um, Santiago. Here, teacher. Welcome. Okay. Um. Wait, sorry. And um, Linda. Linda? No, Linda? No? Okay. Uh, Marlene? Marlene? Yes. Hello, Marlene, can you hear me? Yes, it's there. Oh, okay. All right. Wonderful. Present. All right. Wonderful. Okay. Miguel. Okay. Great. Nelson G. Present. Okay. Welcome. You're welcome. Okay. Um. And Norma? Present teacher. Okay, welcome Norma. And Olga? Present teacher. Okay, welcome Olga. Thank you. Okay. And um uh Rocio. Present teacher. Okay, welcome to see you. Thank you. And Rosa, oh, sorry, Beatriz. Beatriz or Beatriz? Beatriz? Okay. Uh, Suleima Melgar, sorry, no, sorry, sorry. Suleima Rodriguez. Present teacher. Okay. Are you having problems with the camera, Sulima? Sulima? Yes, 
Lima, are you having trouble with the camera? Uh, please give me a moment. Please. Oh. Okay, can you open it up just for the for the attendance or no? Mr. Excuse Boy, me? Can you open the camera just for the attendance or not possible? Yes, yeah. yeah. yes, yes. Oh. One moment. Okay. Solo para que tengamos ahí el registro. Okay, in the meantime, I'm going to continue. I'll go back to, to Sulema. Uh, Tatiana? Present teacher. Okay, welcome, Tatiana. No, thank you. you. Okay, wonderful. Thank you. Thank you, Sulema. Okay, and uh, Nelson? Nelson? Present teacher. Wonderful. Thank you, Nelson. And Omar? Present. Okay, welcome, Omar. Suleima Melgar. Suleima Melgar. No. Not here. Okay. Um, and Jose Rodrigo. Jose Rodrigo? No, okay. All right, let me make sure that I haven't missed anybody. The people that I did not hear are Ana Maria, Carolina, Linda. I'm here to hear. Who is that? I'm um, Ana. <laughs> Linda, oh. teacher. Uh, Ani or Ana Maria? Oh, no, Ana no, Maria. Ana Maria. Okay. And Linda, teacher, I'm here. Okay, okay. All right. Eh, Ana Maria? Yes. Eh, bye. Dos cositas. Eh, uno, que se me puede cambiar el nombre para que aparezca su nombre. Um, porque ahorita aparece como Galaxy A11. Ah, ah, ok. Entonces necesito que le cambie el nombre. Y el ah, otro es, ¿será que, es, que, que puede encender la camarita? Sí. Ah, ok. Oh, perfect. Excellent. Ok, thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, Ana María, ah, pues sí, solamente hágame el favor de cambiarle. Ah. Y... Ok. All right, so I cannot, I have not heard Ca Carolina, Beatriz, Zulema. Yes, ah, ok, one, welcome. Late. Okay, thank you for connecting. Suleima Melgar and Jose Rodrigo. De ahí todos están, ¿verdad? ¿Sí? Sí. Yes, teacher. Okay. Good, good. Okay. Um, okay. Um, okay. All right, guys and girls. Um, so, uh, first of all, ¿qué tal? ¿Cómo, ¿Cómo nos fue con la plataforma? Any questions, any problems that you had? Vamos bien. ¿Sí? Quiero una consulta. Mm -hmm. eh, um, siempre van a haber esos problemitas, así como los que tuvimos aquella vez, de que por el punto no se tomaban como buenas o por la mayúscula o cosas así. La, la, la uh, plataforma está programada para aceptar ciertas respuestas. O sea, ya están determinadas esas respuestas que se dan. Entonces, eh, si usted no pone el punto, o si usted um, se le olvida poner una mayúscula, lo que sea, eh, entonces sí le va a salir como que está equivocado. Entonces, lo que va a tener que hacer usted es eh, revisar, con revisar, que usted no, no se le haya escapado una letra, que no se le ha escapado la mayúscula o, o la, la puntuación correcta. Eso sí, sí es, um, es algo porque ya está determinada la respuesta y tiene que ser justo así. ¿Ok? Ok. ¿Alguna preguntita además de eso que tengan?
¿No? ¿Todo está claro entonces? Yes, no ha habido ningún otro problema. ¿No? Ok. Vale. Entonces, eh, acuérdense, si ahora, acuérdense que es, eh, esta, esta semana no necesita entregar nada de, de, um, de la plataforma porque uno se va a terminar la unidad dos hasta la siguiente, siguiente semana. Y lo otro porque mañana, pues como no tenemos clase, entonces se corre, ¿verdad? Entonces sería, terminaríamos el lunes la, la unidad, no, no viernes. ¿Ok? Eh, ok, entonces solo uh, recordarlo, recordarle de eso. Okay. Which, which unit? Which, which unit? Um, number two or... Yes, you need to. But, o oh, otra cosa que les quería decir, pero a pesar que, eh, de que no se va a, digamos, no, no vamos a terminar esta semana, pero uh, les hago, les recuerdo de que sí tenemos que completar el midterm. Vamos a tener prácticamente dos entregas, una de la unidad 2 y el otro del midterm. ¿verdad? Entonces, tienen que tener cuidado ahí con eso. ¿Ok? ¿Questions? About the midterm. Este, como se dice que tenemos un plazo para entregarlo, ¿verdad? Yo, este, bueno, mi pregunta es que si al momento de que lo vamos a empezar a hacer, ¿lo tenemos que terminar o es como por partes? No me es primera vez que voy a hacer una evaluación. Uh, bye, pero hágame la pregunta otra vez que no entendí muy bien la, 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 la pregunta. Vaya, tenemos hasta una fecha límite para, para entregarlo, uh -huh. pero al momento que nosotros lo, lo empecemos a hacer, digamos, tenemos unas dos horas o por decirlo así para terminarlo. O se puede como ir haciendo por partes. Ah, no, 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 no. El, el midterm es igual que también los otros ejercicios. Um, usted lo va haciendo a su paso. Y como yo le mencionaba um, el, eh, en el primer día de clase, que um, hay, hay alumnos que, que en la primera semana terminan toda la plataforma, incluyendo el, el midterm y el final exam. Ahí está abierto y usted puede trabajar en eso cuando se quiera. ¿Ok? No sé si, si, si está claro o, o todavía tiene alguna duda. Sí, ya claro. Gracias. Oh, ok. Sí, entonces está abierto. Ahorita eh, usted puede hacerlo cuando usted quiera. No hay ningún inconveniente. Ok. ¿Any other questions? No, no, teacher. Okay. Okay. Va. ok, muy bien. Entonces, en ese caso, um, me supongo que entonces todo está claro, que vamos a estar entregando hasta qué fecha. ¿Qué fecha tenemos para entregar? Next Monday. Next Monday. No. Ah. Hasta la siguiente semana. Acuérdense lo que les, les acabo de decir, que vamos a, ter, vamos a tomar dos, um, dos um, semanas para hacer la unidad dos. Entonces, como, como vamos a tomarnos dos semanas, eh, en teoría te, tendríamos que estar entregando como le voy a decir en teoría, tendríamos que estar entregando el 20, pero como mañana no hay clase, entonces no vamos a tener, terminar la unidad, 20, la unidad 2 en el, el 20, sino que hasta el 23. Entonces, pero yo les sugiero que a pesar que, que van a entregar hasta el 23, no esperen hasta el 23 para hacerlo. Utilicen, eh, utilicen ese tiempo que tengan para ir avanzando en la plataforma. Okay. 
porque también. ¿Aló? Creo que me corté de momento, ¿verdad? Eh, bueno, um, sí, utilicen ese tiempo para ir avanzando en la plataforma porque um, después van a estar ahí corriendo y haciendo los ejercicios mal y, y diciendo, teacher, no sé qué hacer con esto, cómo es, ¿verdad? Y entonces mejor hagámoslo tranquilito, con calma, ¿ok? ¿Any other questions that you guys have? No, teacher. No? No, teacher. It's clear. Okay, good. Good, good, good. Okay, so what I'm going to do then is I'm going to start sharing. Tell me, can you see my PowerPoint? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, good. Um, excellent. Okay, so let's check. Um, so we're gonna today is uh, we're gonna be looking at the four P's of the marketing mix. Okay, we're gonna discover what are the four P's. Okay. Um, so, uh, your facilitator is Jessica Guerrero. It's the intermediate three and it's class number six. Okay. All right. Um, good. So, let's start. Um, oh, hold on. Wait a second. Sorry, guys, let me just check something here. Okay, all right, sorry guys, um, let's try this again. Okay, can you guys see it? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes. Okay, good. All right, so, um, okay, so handling the decline of a product. Do you remember we read this um, last class? Yes, teacher. Okay, good. What we're gonna do right now is I'm going to be putting you into pairs. You're going to be reading the article out loud. So maybe one of you can read the first paragraph, this, the other one can read the second paragraph, and then the first person can read the third paragraph. Yes, see, right. We're going to go back and forth. And what I want you to do is I want you to circle words that you don't understand. Okay? And try to find out if your partner knows those words. Okay? Sounds good? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. All right, I'm going to put you into breakout rooms with a partner. Okay, and we're going to open the rooms.
Em Zoom? Em Zoom? Hello? Hello? Hi, teacher. Good evening. Hi, Linda. I'm checking my, my screenshot. <laughs> mm. I'm reading. Okay. The paragraph. Okay. So, uh, Santiago is not there, is he? Oh, okay. there he is. Okay. Okay, great. Okay. So I'm going to check my power. My, my. Hi, Santiago. Is Rob a successful existing business? Apple thought, if we don't do something, someone else will. Okay. Uh, and even, even today, the speed, the drama, dramatic 42% fall, the Apple run still generates big revenues. I don't know how to read that. 973. <laughs> 973 million, I think. Millions, I guess. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. um, but 973 million out of Apple total revenues is just a mirror sideline, minor sideline, or as technology news site, the Verge put it a hobby, which lets most people in the known to predict that will Apple may not discontinue the, Apple, the iPod in the very near future, with unlikely to see any kind of significant update of the device. Okay. Mm. Um. Um. So you're going to start now. <laughs> Sorry. So first, I have one question, teacher. Um, we only going to read, or um, yes, you're going to be reading, but you're also going to be discussing the vocabulary, words that you don't understand. You can discuss. Okay, only that. Okay. All right. Okay. Twelve years and twenty-six device later, the generation defining iPod range look like it's about to fade into history about so much as a whimper. I think all of us have known for something that iPod is a declining business, said Apple boss Tim Cook in 2014 discussing the company's the company's late, latest earnings report the announcing massive profits as never but note that ipod sales has dipped 42 percent down on this time in 2013 with founders drop sped 
and I would have been ner nervously looking over his shoulder for some time when the iPhone was launched in 2000. I don't know. <laughs> 2007. 2007. Uh -huh. 2007. Steve Jobs joked that it was the best iPod we'd never we'd ever make. And he was right. With it ups and other smartness, the iPhone meant, meant uh, there was no longer any need to own an iPod as a separate device, so long as you could afford it. Apple wasn't afraid to create a product that would disrupt a su successful existing business. Apple told, told, if we don't do something, someone else will. And even today, despite the dramatic 52% fall, the iPhone range still generates big revenues. 973 millions, but 973 million out of Apple's total revenue is just a minor sideline, or as a technology news site, The Verge put it, a hobby which leaves most people in the new, in the know, the, to predict that. While Apple may not discontinue the iPod in the very near future, we're unlikely to see any kind of significant update of the devices. Okay. So do you find any, any words that we need to look it up? Mm, yes, I don't know what is fail in the first line. And they say about to fade into star history. I don't know what it's Yes. Two percent full. The iPod Ranger still generates by Remus to uh, 973 M, but 973 M out of an Apple today renews is just a miniature see the line or as a technologic new city, the Verge, but it's a hobby which leads most people in the know to predict that while Apple may not discontinue the iPhone in the very near future, we are unlikely to see any kind of significant update of the device. Uh, right now, we're going to choose uh, the word that we don't know the meaning, and we're going to ask the teacher, I think. Okay. Yes. Oh. Uh, Before you ask the teacher, you have to um, discuss with your group if, you, if other people in the group know the word. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, perfect. Only practice. Yes. Or more. <laughs> no, no, you are going to choose oh, the beginning. Right. Let's go about fate. To fate is true. Fate, I don't know. I don't remember. Do you know what the meaning fate? Fate. Fate. Yes. Fate. It's in mm. the. Say something like it's about in the first line. Uh, looks like it is about to the fade into the history without so much as a whimper. Ah, whimper. I don't know what they mean. It is about to the fade. 
if he must have snow for something. I mean to say, to fate, fracaso, creo que es. Descolorar, apagarse. ¿Mm? Many, many means. The fight. So it's last the another so yes. yes. Okay. I found a synonym that all of the synonym. 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 That he says that is throw into disorder. That is one of the um, words that I have that question that it was. What was it? I don't know if you have another word to look for it. Do you have any work? Or you have all the work? Repeat, please. <laughs> Do you have any word that you don't know the meaning, or do, or did you look the meaning of all of them? On oh, the all of the. You guys have questions, anything, any problems? No questions, no problems? I can't hear you. <laughs> That's okay? Okay, we'll most read all the paragraphs. And we say, all the things that we understood about it. Okay. Okay. Well, then you can continue then.
Eh, so yo no escucho nada que hablen. Hello? Do you guys hear me? Hello? Hello, teacher. Hi, okay. Pensaba que era mi sonido que no estaba funcionando. Okay. We are here. Okay, good. Ajá. Ya, o sea, sí leímos, ya leímos el para, párrafo. We wrote, read the paragraph and we discussed about the decline. Okay. And you, you understand all the vocabulary? No, no, no all of them. No, okay. no todo, teacher. Hay palabras que no sabemos. That, that's exactly what we're doing right now. Es precisamente por lo que nos mandé acá para hacer, para to talk about the, the, the vocabulary that you don't understand. Uh -huh, I was looking for despite or absurd. I looking in a dictionary right now. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, okay. So um, you, okay, so you're looking in the dictionary. Are you sharing with each other? I don't know if, um, ¿cómo se llama el chico? Kevin. Kevin. Are you there, Kevin? No, teacher. Voy a seguir buscando la, las, las palabras, teacher, porque no. Los significados de lo que no entiendo lo, lo estoy buscando ahorita. De algunas palabras. Ok. All right. Uh -huh. um, but the idea is to discuss together. That's kind of the idea what we're, we wanted to do. But um, okay. All right. Go ahead then. Okay. Kevin. Hello? Hello? Suleyma Nelson? Hi. What happened? Um, we practice and... Uh-huh. You practice and Did you guys do the vocabulary. Did you do the vocabulary or no? I don't Hi, teacher. Hi. Did you do the yes, vocabulary? There, there are. Uh, so much new vocabulary, huh? more technical, technical or digital. Right, yes. So did you already talk about the vocabulary? Okay. Well, you haven't talked about it. For example, I mean, understand. Wimp, whimper, whimper, uh huh. Uh huh. Uh, what is the mean? Yeah, th that's why we're what we're doing right now. Um, I want you to discuss with your partner if your partner knows the meaning of the word whimper. And if you don't, then we'll discuss it in class together. 
Oh, okay. Okay. So you um you already discussed that? You discussed all the words that you don't understand? I don't understand you, teacher. Uh, did you already under discuss with your partner the words that you did you don't understand? You you have mm, words you don't understand. Palabras, que si hay más palabras que no hemos entendido con el compañero. Okay, there are words that you don't understand, right? Words that you don't understand. There are words that exist that you don't understand, right? Do you understand my question? No, teacher. Open your camera, please. So I can see your face because otherwise I don't know what's going on if. Okay. Also, also Ivan. Uh, sorry, Nelson, if you can open up. <laughs> Okay. Okay. There are there's vocabulary in the article that you don't understand, right? Hello. Do you do you hear me? Sí, teacher, pero que no sé por qué no lo entiendo la pregunta. Okay. There is vocabulary in uh -huh. the article that you don't understand, uh -huh. right? Yes. Okay, there, good. There are. Okay, good. Did you discuss with Nelson what the vocabulary means? Did you say, Nelson, do you know the meaning of this word? I don't understand this word. Do you know the meaning? Nelson, did you say, Suleyma, do you, what is the meaning of this word? Did you discuss? Discuss? Did you discuss? Pero si no las entendemos, ya las andamos buscando también. Okay, mm -hmm. because words that I don't understand, maybe my partner knows. Words that my partner doesn't know, maybe I know. Oh, okay. Yes, we are sharing, mm -hmm. we are sharing our knowledge. Yes. Okay, teacher. Okay, so mm -hmm. you say, ah, oh, yes, I think, I think the word means this. Okay. Yes, do we understand? Okay. Yes, 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 I understand you. Okay, Nelson, does that make sense? Nelson? Can you hear me? Yes. Yes? Does that make sense? Do you understand what I'm saying? Yes, I understand. Nelson? Me escucha bien o... Yes, teacher. Okay. Do you understand? Does that make sense what I'm saying? Yes. Yeah? Okay, good. Excellent. Okay, go ahead. I'll give you about two more minutes and then we're going to go back to the group. Okay? Okay, teacher. <clears throat> um, Nel hey, teacher. Hi. Are you finished? Um, yes, it's only read the the paragraph, right? And write the, the words I don't understand. Right? Yeah, discuss the words that you don't understand. So uh, you can you can say, Nelson, do you know the meaning of this word? And then Nelson says, oh, yes, I think it means this. And um, then Nelson will ask you, did you do that? Yes. Okay, wonderful, perfect. Okay, uh, I will see you in the main room in a few minutes. Okay.
se queda como en el aire con todo lo demás. Uh -huh. Ok. Ok. En mi caso, I don't know whimper. En. Um, earnings is listen listen What? earning Hello, are we finished? Yes, yes teacher, we finished. Great. Okay, I'll see you in the, in the main room in about a minute, okay? Okay. Thank you. Okay, in the meeting of Wimper, uh, I found that it's like cry to cry. I don't know how to relation with the paragraph, but the, te <laughs> the teacher will help us. Hi, are you guys finished? Girls finished? Yes. Yes? Yes. Okay, great. All right, I'll see you in the main room right now, okay? Okay. okay. Thank you. Okay, all right guys, um, first thing I'm gonna do, I need to take attendance, so um, please cameras on, make sure your camera is on everybody. I still see we have a few people that don't have the camera on. Okay. Okay. Um, okay. So we'll start with um, Ani. Present teacher. Great. Um, Ana Maria. Present teacher. Great. Carolina. Carolina. Is it teacher? Ah, oh, yes, she, but she, she hasn't come in yet, right? Okay, um, Emily? Present. Great, Hazel? Hazel? Okay, I guess she's not here anymore. She was here for a moment. Um, okay, uh, Joanna? Joanna? Oh, Present. Okay. Uh, Jorge? Present, teacher. Okay, great. Um, Karina? Present. Great. Uh, Carla? Present, teacher. Excellent. Santiago? 
Santiago. Not here anymore. Okay, I guess it's not here. Okay, Linda. Linda, Linda, Linda. Linda's not here. Okay. Como que se nos fueron después de, se nos perdieron después del. Ay, she's coming back. Okay. Linda. Present teacher. Hi, okay. All right, great. Uh, Marlene? Yes, ma'am. Okay, wonderful. Miguel? Present. Excellent. Nelson? Present. Okay, very good. Norma? Norma? No? Okay. Olga. Present teacher. Okay. Uh, Rocio. Present. Okay, very good. Uh, Beatriz. Present. Okay, great. Suleima Rodriguez. Present teacher. Okay, great. Uh, Tatiana. Present. Great. Uh, Nelson A. Present. Great. Uh, Omar. Present. Great. Suleima Melgar. And Jose Rodrigo. Okay. All right. Um, okay. So now we've done that. So let's just, now that we have that, let's discuss um, the, um, let's discuss the exercise, the, the vocabulary. So I know some of you, you were able to work with your partner and, and figure out some of the words, but um, not all the words, right? So that's what we're gonna be looking at together. All right, so I'm gonna be sharing. Tell me when you can see my PowerPoint. Yeah. Yes, sure. Yeah? Yes. Okay, great. So uh, I want you to write in the chat the vocabulary that you don't understand, that after even talking with your partner, you still don't understand the vocabulary. Just give me a moment. Okay, wow, there's a lot of words. Okay. You know what I think I'm gonna do because I can see there's lots of words and I'm probably gonna be spending too much time by, by circling each one of the words. Let me just address the word and um, look at the context and we'll see what it means, okay? I think that'll be better. Okay, so the first word is whimper. And where is the word whimper? Can you, oh, here, this one right here, okay. All right, the word whimper here means, whimper is, is um, a sound that you make to sh show that you, um, that you feel bad about a situation. So it's like, for example, it's like, it's a way of complaining, like, uh, for example, dogs do this a lot. You get, you know, when a dog is sad, you know the sound that they make. 
And they go, yes. That's whimper. Okay, so whimper is a sound that you make to show that you either um, you you either feel sad or you are in pain. Okay, does that make sense? Yes, yes. Sure. Okay, good. All right, so that's that word. Meant. Um, I think meant, if I'm not mistaken, is yeah the iPhone meant. Oh, okay. Uh, it meant is the simple pass of mean. Okay. Mean, to have a meaning. Right? How do you say uh, mean in Spanish? Significado. 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 Exactly. The iPhone meant there was no longer. So el, el iPhone significaba que ya no había. Okay. Necesita. Nice. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. Then we have fade. Um, where is fade? Fade. Can you find fade? Fade is something First that time. disappear. Which one? Uh, mm -hmm. Yes, it is. Sure. But where where is fade? The, the, my question the is first that. line in the first line. In the first line. The first line. Say about to fade into history. Ah yes yes. Uh, okay. All right. So um, let's have a. Okay, um, so looks like it's about to fade. Fade means, yeah, like disappear, but it's not just disappear, right? All of a sudden, the word fade has the meaning of disappearing little by little, okay? So it's not, it, it becomes less and less and less visible until you can't see it anymore, okay? So it disappears, yes, yes. boom, it disappears. But no, mm -hmm. fade is more like it disappears little by little until you don't um, see anything. Okay? Yeah. All right. Then we have the word dipped. Dipped. Uh, where is dipped? Oh, okay. I will show the To dip means to go like this, right? Like, have you ever, you guys um, have probably seen like, like swimmers, they dip in the ocean, like they go like, they go like that. So that's kind of the, the idea of dipping, right? So it goes to go down, okay? To decline, okay? Como fondo, algo así, profundo. No, mm. it's, 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 it means to decline. Sumergido. Ah, okay. Dejar bajarse. Like it goes, o sea, Sumergirse. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Launch. Okay, launch. When the iPhone was launched in 2007. Um, it means to launch. It means to send something in a in a direction. Okay, it's very similar to Spanish. In Spanish, you say lan lanza, right? To throw something. Mm -hmm. exactly. Okay. La whimper. Yeah, we talked about that. Dipped. We talked about that. Dip. Dip. Despite. Um, let's see, where's the spite? Despite, despite, despite. Um, it's like even do. Yes, yes, but I'm just trying to find the word. Where is the word despite? Somebody help me. 
a pesar de. Oh, yeah, yes, 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 I found it. Okay, yeah. So despite is, is a word that we use for a contraction. Sorry, sorry, contrast, sorry, a contrast. So even, and even today, despite the dramatic 52% fall, so it means um, it's like a, even though the dramatic 52% fall, all right, um, even if apart from that, okay? Does that make sense? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes, yes. Okay, great. Uh, okay, um, so then we have the word further. And where's further, 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 further? Further, further. Somebody can help me? I'd really appreciate that. Further. The location. Is... Nobody can see the word further? No. I remember read further. Joanna, where did you see the word further? Um, in the five line. Oh. Five. five, number five. Um, oh, on yeah. this time into Oh, yes. with the second paragraph, yes. Yes. No, the first paragraph. Yes, okay. Oh, yes. Further the is the, the comparative of far. So far, okay? So you, you understand far, right? But uh, you say farther when it's a distance, when we're talking about distance. But in this case, when you say further, because there are two, right? I'm going to write it in, in the chat. The comparative of the word far, you can add farther. Or further. Okay. Um, like that. And in this case, farther means talking about distance, like Right. Um, so, for example, yeah, I can say, for example, um, my house is farther from a, from English corporativo than your house, for example. Okay. Um, but further with a U means the same thing, más lejos, but not in terms of distance. We can use it for any other form. Um, for example, I can say, I want to go further with my studies. I want to go further with my studies. Quiero ir más lejos con mis estudios. In that case, we're not talking about distance, right? Uno no va más lejos de distancia con los estudios. It's more figurative figuratively speaking, okay? Does that make sense? Yes, no? Yes, teacher. Yeah? Yeah? Yes, teacher. Okay, all right. Okay, let's continue then. The next word, um, there a minute. disrupt. Where is disrupt? Disrupt, disrupt, disrupt. Teacher, disrupt is in the second paragraph, uh, the line before the last one is disrupt. Ah, so Apple was afraid to create a that would disrupt a successful business. Disrupt means to make a, to disturb. You understand disturb? 
bother to bother 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 okay um bother or um or um disturb you know the word disturb annoying could be not so much annoying disturb um interrupt interrupt disturb interrupt okay Does that in spanish mm -hmm. yeah okay yes all right um strip the strip the strip revenues revenues where is the word revenues <laughs> In the last paragraph. Money. In the in the last paragraph, second line. Uh, Apostolal revenues. Ah, okay. Okay. Revenues means um, the the amount of money that somebody makes with a sale. Okay. Uh, so it says here, um, but nine, $973 million out of Apple's total revenues is just a minor silent or, um, so it's like all of the, the money that they make from the sales. Like profits. Similar to profits. Yes. Yeah. It's all the money that comes in. Is earnings teacher hmm? main thing main says earnings earnings yes but earnings are for a household whereas revenues are for a business okay thank you so uh, so um yeah earnings are in a house like all the money that people in a house make and like mom dad and um the children and revenues is for a business. Okay. All right. Earnings, which is, we already talked about that. Earnings. Where's the word earnings? I can't find the word earnings. Anybody know? Is the word earnings? Late. It's in the, the first, first paragraph. It's four. Line Eight. three. Four. No, four. Ah, the latest earnings. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So earnings is all the money, is, is how much the money the company makes. Okay. like the makes in money, okay? All right, is that pretty clear? Yes, teacher. Yes? Yes. Okay. Uh, Okay, uh, let's continue. We have um, Mint. We already talked about Mint. Merch. Bite. Sideline. Sideline. Where's Sideline? Sideline. Ah. Isn't the last? Oh, yes. Yeah. I know. Okay. Uh, sideline is like um, something that is not very important. Okay. Um, something that is um, so it's not like it's not a main topic it's just something uh, something a smaller topic let's say that is not very important does that make sense 
Yes, no? Yes, teacher. Okay. So it's like it's so it's it's not the main thing. It's just something extra, let's say. Um, I'll give you an example. Um, imagine I have a job. Okay. I have a job um, that gives me money, like a very stable job from um, you know, 40, 44 hours a, a week. But um, I want to make more money. So I don't get a second job. Instead, I start, I maybe I I sell some products from a magazine. And I make some sideline money. So sideline money means the money that I make is not the main amount of money. It's not where I, my main income is. It's just kind of like extra. Okay. okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. And then we have, we talked about fur, further verge. 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 If you guys can help me with the word verge. I, I think the verge is the name of the new site. In the last Silent, paragraph. Silent, Silent or as technologies new site, the verge put it. Oh, yes. The verge is the name of the, the technology news. The, sorry, the technology news site. Okay. Yes. Unlikely. Where is okay? I, I found it. Unlikely means that there the possibility is very small. There's a small possibility. Okay. Um, Now, yeah, it, it normally, like, I mean, in this context, the verge is the name, right? But uh, when you say for, you can also have a meaning that says on the verge. For example, uh, we are on the verge of a breakthrough. It's like when you say in Spanish, estamos a punto de, right? It's just right on the edge, almost. Okay. Does that make sense? Yes, teacher. Okay. Uh, and I think that's it. Yeah, I think we got we covered all the the vocabulary. Teacher, uh, uh, in the in the last paragraph, there are a word that that has a, a line in the no, in the no. That is a word, complex word, or in the last part, the meaning oh. in the no. People in the no. Yes. In the no means people that are aware of something people that are that have the knowledge about something like yeah? sabios or not exactly sabios but it's like um los los conocedores los que están los que están al día los que saben i don't know mm -hmm. how to say that in spanish expertos you say? Yeah, kind of, but it's more, it's very informal. It's very informal. Um, so I wouldn't say like experto because experto sounds more formal. Um, Actualizado. Or be saying like los conocedores del tema. Los que van al día. <laughs> los que? Como los que van al día de lo que se está hablando. Uh -huh, kind of mm -hmm. like that, yeah. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah. Okay. Any other words? No, teacher. All right. Perfect. 
So let's clear this. Um, okay, so now that we've done that, let's go on to this activity, working groups. It says working groups identify the strategies that Apple, um, sorry, identify the strategies that uh, Apple has applied to deal with the imminent declining of the iPod. So um, choose a national product or service that is in the decli declining stage. Discuss the possible strategies that the manufacturing or distributing company could apply. What advantages would those uh, would those strategies bring to the company? So right now, uh, you're going to be working in, gr in groups and you're going to be discussing um, the different stages that um, that a company that in this moment has a, a product or a service that is declining, what could they do? Does that make sense? Yes, no? Yes. Yeah? Yeah. Yes, teacher. Okay. All right, perfect. So we're gonna put you guys into breakout rooms. Um, let's make breakout rooms of four people. No, three, three to four. And I'm gonna give you 15 minutes to discuss this. Teacher, one yeah. question. Yeah. The, the answer that that this question is based on the the article that we read before. The article gives you different stages that um, Apple applied for the iPod. So using those stages, you can discuss it. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. So I'm going to give you 12 minutes actually. Okay. Let's open up the rooms. Girls, do you understand what to do? Mr. Yes, you understand what to do, girls? Yes, we are thinking about the, the product or service we're going to talk about. Mm -hmm. Okay, wonderful. Okay. Yes, the products. Is completely For example, is computers computers of this. For example, yes. 
Yes, it can be. Se podría ser, ¿verdad? Computadora de escritorio. O oh, other strokes. You. Usted tiene otro producto. I was thinking about about bees. Uh, but it can be. This computer, but what is going to be the, the strategy? Mm, okay. That it can apply. Mm, the strategy, for example. Mm -hmm. Sería la estrategia. Mm -hmm. Could be eliminate the 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 PU and okay. put all in in one. Could be yes. a, a strategy. I don't know. More small. For example, mm -hmm. okay. Mm. All that is simple, only. It can be It can be maybe, I don't know what is the name, but offer gadgets can be as a earphones, microphones, then you can add to like a package when you buy one. I don't know what else, maybe a, a webcam. Yes, okay. could be. Uh, but I think the the new the new computer. Ah, mm -hmm. uh, sí. Uh -huh. Yes. <laughs> I know. Yes. So we could could put that. Uh, I don't. Uh, that the new the new one has has the. The camera and the mic, mic. But it's it, it's good when you are learning or what, when you are learning about marketing. But <laughs> about the topic, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, That's right. <laughs> but it's so hard for me. I don't like yeah. it. <laughs> <laughs> but I try. I try. Um. Yeah. It's good. Yes. So, um, what advantage will those strategies bring to the company? Um, get more revenues. <laughs> get more it's revenues. A possibility. Yes, it's a possibility. Yeah. Um. Better. Yeah. Um, 
better place for enjoy the meal with the family, um, mm -hmm. friends, I think. But this is uh, advantages to the people, I think, and to the company. Mm. To get more, <clears throat> more customers to yes, okay. more publicity, mm -hmm. um, better. Uh, I don't know. Customers. I don't remember what I say. Ingressos. Revenues. Revenues. Yes. Revenues. Uh -huh. Yes. Um, uh, revenues. Revenues. Uh -huh. um, I don't know. How to what get I more know. customers yes. and revenues. Customer and revenues. Um, publicity. How about Maybe. good publicity? Yeah. Mm -hmm. good. good publicity. And let me think. Um, I don't know how to say to get a, a part of the or a portion of the cake <laughs> the cake of the in in the in the Le podemos poner. They can put it from home. The people use the photos, the printing photo for the memories, for the gift, for the special location. The people use printing printing photos or photo printing. I don't know what photo printing is. Eh? Mm -hmm. Photo printing. To the special kitchen and gift. ¿Qué más dije? Me olvidó. Give Bluetooth. And, hmm? Bluetooth. No, le estoy diciendo que la gente ya solo imprime las fotos en ocasiones especiales. Especial. Para regalar. Para regalar. Ajá. Vaya. Vaya, yo creo que la uno ya la tenemos. Ok. Ahora, Best. the number two. This is possible possible strategies that the manufacturing distributing distributing company could pudieron aplicar uh -huh. pudieron aplicar um, pegado no sé Ahí es porque la tecnología los dejó atrás. Ajá. Bueno, pero en el caso de Kodak, por ejemplo, ellos ahora venden cosas, venden tecnología, ya no venden solo fotos. Ya venden la impresora, uh -huh. que es para, para, hacer, para, ajá, para hacerlo uno mismo. Ajá, entonces las, las otras compañías que se dedicaban a eso. Let's keep it in English, guys. Let's keep it in English. Ok. And Then they don't, the other company. Don't update, actualizarse, update. They don't update. Uh, ¿Cómo así? No se actualizaron. Ajá, este, no se actualizaron. Y no... O no tenían presupuesto. Entonces... 
I don't have, not, not tuvieron, I don't have the, the they vision. Updated. They don't update it with the technology. Uh -huh. Update it. With technology. With the technology. They don't update or, the technology. Okay. Or don't innovate. No innovaron mm -hmm. because uh, like uh, rough they sell a device for or I don't know, different types of printers for printer from home, printing from home. Uh, the medium. Are you ready? Or maybe you guys need more time. Um, we're going to make a presentation. Uh, you're going to be presenting to the class, yes. I Okay, uh, I think that we are ready. <laughs> ready? Excellent, okay. Um, All right, I will see you in the main room in a moment. Okay. Partners, uh, the product is the Hi guys, are we finished? Yes, teacher. Yes? Okay, I'll see you in the main room in a moment. Okay. Praise our uh, um, at the company to win to the traditional. Mm. And I think that the, in these uh, slides, you can put the image that I sent you. You can put in the presentation. Uh, for me, complicated, but because I, I cell phone is more difficult yes. for me. Yes, I think that I can. In the cell phone, in the presentation. Yeah. Just uh, let me. For me, it's more difficult. Thing. Mm. Okay, um, I'm on the computer. Y the last one, what advantage were to the strategy between the company? Mm -hmm. Each packaging, uh -huh. uh, the strategy they use is to change packaging to more practical ones. Yes, but I think that they have a, a package like one quarter or not. A little mm. presentation that it cost uh, a quarter, I think. Quarter, yeah. Yeah, okay. Uh, uh, economic presentation. Yes, 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 yes. Um, let me see if I can find this presentation to put into the slides. Thank <laughs> you. 
has different presentation, uh, different price, maintenance, the quality of the product. Yes. The quality of the product. Um, I think that I I can't share my screen. Um, could someone present the the PowerPoint? Mm -hmm. I don't know if someone can uh, share the screen to to make the presentation. I can't do it. Mm. I can't do it too. But I am my cell phone is very difficult. Nelson, are you in, in your computer or in your cell phone? In the cell phone. Okay. Kevin, are you in your computer or in your in your cell phone? No, um, I'm still working right now. Okay. Yes. I can share, no, I can share the presentation with my computer. I don't know what is happening. I will intend to, I will not know. No, I can't. I Are know. you guys finished? Um, no, <laughs> no, not yet. No, not yet, but. Two, two more minutes, okay? Okay. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. I'm going to try. Okay, can you, uh, Norma? Uh, right. Podemos poner offer with. Eh, pagando así de contado puede hacer porque son productos que no los these are products that the people don't don't pay in 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 one pay mm -hmm. <laughs> the, the people all the time pay by month no paints no paints uh, or we can put one it. strategy could be uh, see it's month without in uh, interest mm -hmm. discount uh, I don't know if we can put that mm -hmm. or or the six month without interest one of that I don't know. Or both. Or both. I I see in different books that it says the word sales. I don't know if they are for offers. Do you know? Sales. Sales. Uh -huh, like this. Swiss moms. Yes, it's something like. Uh, with six months without interest with uh, i don't know uh, all the all the the products are with discount 
some sometime. Mm -hmm. Stay. Uh -huh. But okay, so uh, six months without what? Uh, six months without stars. Mm -hmm. Interest. Okay. It will be to sell the computers in a cheaper way. Mm. Well, how? Mm, well, well, that is like a like that is. Okay, that's finished. Yes, you ready? Yes, teacher. Yes. Can we present? Yes. Okay. Um, okay, so we'll start with the first group. Group number one is Joanna, Kevin, Nelson, and Norma. And Nelson G. Uh, so one of you guys can open up your microphone and share with the class what you talked about. Okay, let me share my screen. Mm -hmm. <laughs> And we're going to talk about um, aceite, oil, El Dorado. Okay. We choose this product because we know that this is on the stage of decline in El Salvador. Um, this oil was used um, since, I don't know, 20 years ago. Um, and these are the strategies that we recommend to the packaging and manufacturing distribution. Uh, the first one is replace the product. The second one is modify the product. And the third one is rebranding strategies. And the first one is uh, we recommend that they went to the traditional. Uh, they sought to make the product something more practical to use. For example, in, in the past, we know that this oil was in, in the glass package, in the jar package. Okay. And now we, we recommend that they change the type of package that they use to plastic, for example, that is more practice to use. And to practical. use, what? More practical. Yes, more practical. And to use the little, I don't know how you say, tapones. Caps? Uh -huh. The taps uh, with the plastic package. The second one, uh, Norma, can you help me please? Okay, the second uh, is modify the product. The strategy we recommended is to change the packing to, sorry, sorry. Uh, yeah, uh, to more practical ones, no longer with the glass packaging, but they use in plastic packaging more practical and in different presentation. Okay. This is, yes. The, the, the different uh, presentation, uh, oh. different uh, prices too. Yes, for example, in this mark, uh, in this brand, I'm sorry, we have uh, an economic um, presentation that it costs one quarter. And that's why we are recommending that um, apply the product to the 
uh, economic to the economy of the market. Okay. And the third one, Nelson, can you help me please? Okay. To rebranding study, the, the concept of the rebranding means a charm or the brand or a reason or identification is a marketing strategy in with a new name, there is a symbol, design or a combination is a credit for an established uh, brain. El Dora, you say is a song, song night about with Amor is chill the sign and it is a uh, it is so uh, that it is a uh, still in the market the spirit a lot of a competition competition in the market. Okay. That's all. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Okay. All right. Okay, and we have time for one more, uh, which is um, Ana Maria, Suleima, and Tatiana. Okay. Uh, do you remember? I'm going to start. Do you remember? Uh, a fruxy, maybe yes or no. There is the product that we choose uh, for was decline. We, we thought that that kind of product was declined um, for many reasons. And um, uh, one reason could be the presentation. So, uh, Tati, could you help me to say which strategies? We select to 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 improve the company selves for that kind of product. Okay, thank you, Ana Maria. Uh, we were talking about uh, for a better presentation because uh, if you remember the fruity, uh, only it was very I don't know is is a it was sad the just the bottom. And I think for the kid that was not attractive. So uh, we think we, for this product, uh, for a relaunch, re relaunch, we need a better presentation. Uh, we, need, uh, we need to uh, more flavors because uh, before they just have, I think, grape and strawberry. So we need more flavors because the kids uh, like another another flavor like orange like uh, I don't know another another flavor and we need to uh, better our advertising on a, on TV and a relaunch relaunch more attractive. Uh, because that product declined, I think for that reasons, uh, because it wasn't attractive, I think. That's all. And advantage. Uh, the advantage is going to uh, help us, Suleyma, right? Okay. Uh, we think that advantage for the change in the strategies will be uh, the clients are retained and create new clients and identify new opportunities in with this product and others and the cost for the product could be more or less only teacher. Okay, very good. Bravo. Excellent job. Okay. Um, all right, very good. Now, the groups number four, five, and six, you are in luck because we don't have time at this moment, but we will be doing it tomorrow. Okay. Oh, no, sorry, sorry, no, not tomorrow. Wednesday. 
okay? So um, the only problem is that I hope you remember by Wednesday, okay? So try not to forget, review it, um, and we are gonna continue that for Wednesday, okay? Any questions that we have at this moment? Well, teacher. Okay, all right, let's take attendance quickly. Uh, open up your microphone so that we can do this very quickly. Ani? Present. Ana Maria? Present. Carolina? Emily? Present. Hazel? Hazel? Joanna? Present teacher. Okay. Joanna, today we have 101, uh, the, the 101 session, okay? So you can stay after class. Okay. Uh, Jorge? Present teacher. Karina? Present. Carla? Present teacher. Uh, Santiago? Present teacher. Uh, okay, great. Linda? <laughs> Present teacher. Uh, Marlene? Marlene? Present. Cheryl? Present. Nelson? Present. Uh, Norma? Present teacher. Olga? Present. Rocio? Present. Beatrice? Beatrice? Uh, Suleyma? Present. Present. Sorry. Present. I put the microphone. Oh. All right. Uh, Suleyma Rodriguez? Present. Um, uh, Tatiana? Present teacher. Nelson A? Present teacher. Okay, good. Omar? Present. And Jose, uh, Suleyma Melgar? And Jose Rodrigo. Okay. All right, guys, so that's it. I'm going to say tomorrow we don't have class. I will see you until Wednesday, okay? So take care and um, enjoy tomorrow, okay? Thank you. All right, Thank bye. You. Thank, Thank you. you. Have a nice day. Bye. Bye. Good evening. Good evening. Bye. 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 Bye-bye. Bye. Bye. Good night. Good night. Bye. bye. Santiago, are you having problems? Okay. All right, Joanna. Hi, teacher. Hello, welcome. Thank you. How are you? Nice. Yeah? Yes. Okay, good, good. Um, so tell me, um, well, first of all, it's good to I uh, finally have some time there to to meet you and be able to talk. Uh, <laughs> is this your first module here in, in Inglés Corporativo? Yes. Okay, okay. How have you felt? Uh, really good. Okay. Mm -hmm. good. Yes. Okay. You're not having any problems with the platform? No. Just uh, the, the problems that I reported you. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Okay, but other than that, we're okay. No, I don't have no problem. problem. Okay, yeah. all right, good. How have you felt in class? Um, good. I think um, uh, I just uh, have doubts because uh, I see that all the classes are relation to the market, and I don't know if all the 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 program is related to the to the marketing no remember the the program is called inglés para el trabajo or english for work so the idea with this program is that we deal with different areas of different types of jobs okay okay and we get into depth with each type of job Okay. okay, so that means that uh, you know one week, one 
one week we start talking about uh, sorry one one module we start talking about something in particular the next week we uh, sorry the next module we talk about something different but we go more like into depth so that we learn about everything we learn a little bit about everything okay all the different topics okay that makes sense yes yeah yes okay i thought that we just have one topic in all the no. program <laughs> no no we uh we change okay um although normally for each module the the topics have um similarity right like a like a continuation but in the next module we would talk about something different okay 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 yeah um, any other questions that you have? No, any questions. But for to give an example, in unit two, we're talking about marketing. Yes. In unit three, we talk about branding. Yes, but it's relation to the marketing. It's market. related, yeah, because yes. each module is related. Mm -hmm. The module. The next module, we talk about something different. If I'm not mistaken, I don't remember very well, but I think if I'm not mistaken, in the next module, we talk about like um, computers, things like that. Okay. Okay. So it's like every module has like a, a theme. Okay. Yeah. Uh, we talked uh, in the last module. I'll tell, let me see what we talked about in the last module. If there, were, I was, there was one where we talked about uh, the process of making chocolate, for example. Oh. Yeah, <laughs> it was very, it was very interesting, very tasty. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. So each each module is different, basically. Okay. So no, we're not going to be always talking about marketing. Yes, in this one we are, but we're going to be changing in different different times. Okay. 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 All right. Anything else that you want to you're curious about? You want to ask? No. No. Nothing more. No. Nothing. Sure? Yes. Okay. All right. Uh, so uh, all of the the information is clear for you it's there's no doubts do you have any questions about the about the language itself do you have any questions about the language mm, i think that um i wanted to see more uh, grammar because i think that that's um of my weak weakness mm, weakness uh weakness mm -hmm. uh, the grammar part yeah, we do see grammar, um, but we don't focus so much on grammar. We mostly, we try to give you opportunities of using grammar in context when speaking. So not so much writing, but actually using the grammar in speaking, more like that. Yes, I, I see that. Mm -hmm. But um, yeah, but we do explain different things and um, different parts of grammar. Yeah, definitely. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. All right. Anything else? Anything else I can help you with? No. No? You sure? Yes, sure. Oh. All right. All right. Well, um, if there's nothing else, then um, I hope you enjoy your 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 day off tomorrow. And I will see you on Wednesday. <laughs> My day off. <laughs> yeah. No, uh, I I will work. <laughs> You'll be working. Yes. Oh. Okay. Well, at least at night you will have your day off. Or your okay. night off. <laughs> yes. Off. Yes. Thank you. I try to enjoy my day. Good. I hope so. I hope so. Thank you. Okay. All right. Well, take care, Joanna, and see you Wednesday. Okay. Thank you. All right. Bye bye. Bye bye.